So here's my question to you. If you want to quit and you have a hard time believing, how do you get how do you get to the point where your belief and your faith becomes stronger than your circumstances? The answer is by humbling yourself before God and allowing your heart to be tender. See, a lot of times we're, we have peaked in our faith because we can't get to the next level because we're, we're too hard. We've closed out. We, we, we're no longer learning. We're no longer learning. We have hardened our hearts. We've stiffened our necks and we're, we're done. And as Miles Monroe says, if you think you've learned it all, then you can't learn anything new. Once you think you know it all, your, your growth potential is done. And if you allow what you know to limit what you could know, you're in trouble. And so what I'm saying is, is that to, it, there is a way. See, this is the beautiful thing about redemption, is Jesus said that the way to access this thing is through belief which is something everyone has the potential to do. It, it's not based on how much money you make, because if it was, if getting in the kingdom was based on how much money you make, if it was a high number, a lot of us would be in trouble. We could never get there. If it was based on the good deeds you do, I wouldn't be standing here. If, if, it, if it was based on the color of your skin, then that would exclude people who aren't that color, if it was based on the nation that you belong to, that would exclude anybody not part of that nation, right? If it was based on your gender, then that excludes half of the world, one way or the other. But Jesus said, no, no, no. The way you enter this kingdom is just by listening and believing, paying attention, allowing, obeying, hearing, do it. It's that simple. And so, 